Player blood on the inside is closing in. We're going to need a photo to confirm this one. So it's confirmed. The winner is True Analysis with Lab Tech Placing and Lady Clear Blood in Show Position. Whilst photo finish surveillance is provided by Agriculture Canada, the actual supervision and regulation of the racetrack belongs to the Provincial Racing Commission in most provinces. One may sum up the situation by stating that horse racing in Canada is one of the most comprehensive joint ventures we have. Both levels of government, the federal and the provincial, the public and the horse people, the owners, the trainers and the jockeys and drivers all join hands to make the various types of racing fair and exciting with all the respect due to the horses themselves and the public's money wagered on the outcome of each race. After the suspicious result produced by the first test on the randomly selected horse in the harness race, a second test confirmed the first. For this step, a different type of chromatograph was used. A liquid chromatograph. And phenylbutazone showed up again. The result remained suspicious, but we had to wait for the third test before a positive verdict could be reached. There are three official laboratories in Canada. One in Vancouver, one in Toronto, and one in Montreal. Collaboration between them is very close, and the tightly knit network they form with Agriculture Canada makes them the envy of many other countries. All three are privately owned and were contracted for their professional competence. They are inspected more than once a year by Agriculture Canada and take part in a quality assurance program requiring them, for example, to test samples obtained from Agriculture Canada's research centre in Jerseyville, Ontario. These samples contain certain predetermined drugs and the labs must identify them precisely. And of course, all three are members of the International Association of Official Racing Chemists, the prestigious AORC. Our post position is that standard of quality, and we accelerate it from there. Quality is the password at Canadian racetracks. Quality of breeding. Quality of training. Quality of driving. And for the betting public, quality and thoroughness of drug control services. The anxiety seen on faces at the paramutual wickets reflects more the concern regarding one's choice of horse than the fear of being dealt an unfair race. When one's choice is made, one may feel secure to the point of blind faith that no chemical factor is likely to intervene in the outcome. One may feel that we are taking the better's peace of mind seriously even if we don't yell as loud during the race. The betters are having fun. We are working. And that's the way it should be, even if my own work is more fun than chore. The horses are fit and raring to go. In a moment, they'll be pacing behind the gate. As you know, it takes three different tests to confirm a positive analysis or to make a suspicious result positive. The third test did not confirm the suspicions aroused by the first screening. This step used a very modern link-up of two analytical chemistry devices. A gas chromatograph, which separates the components of a complex liquid, and a mass spectrometer, which identifies the components and checks them against a pre-programmed list. This setup is used for a great variety of chemical analyses, including looking for alcohol and other psychotropes in plane and ship pilots, and certain steroids in athletes. As phenylbutazone did not appear in this third result, only a warning will be issued. The official chemist will advise the federal and provincial authorities of the substance suspected through a certificate of suspicious analysis. The Provincial Racing Commission may in turn warn the trainer that more caution should be taken in adjusting the medication schedules or that a positive result might issue from a future official sample. There are many analytical procedures used by the official laboratories, but the need for more knowledge is never-ending, and Agriculture Canada invests in research at its Jerseyville, Ontario Specialized Research Centre. It's post time and the horses are behind the gate. It'll be a race in a few moments. The gate is pulling away and they're off. We have another exciting two minutes in the making. Sure Thing 2 has already taken the lead. 